Two teenagers facing murder charges in the shooting death of another teen appeared before a judge today. One of their mothers was in court as prosecutors revealed they want to try those teenagers as adults. CBS 4's Peter Dench has been uh, is at the scene of the shooting in Homestead. He's been covering the story since it first was reported. Peter? Well, Elliot, both teens who police say came to this park with handguns are going to be held in secure detention until another hearing at the end of the month. That's when we could find out if they will, in fact, be charged as adults. Now, LaToya McKinney listens intently as her 16-year-old son, Eddie Moore, seen here, appears before a judge. Is this your first time in court? Doesn't matter. All right. Moore is in court for a detention hearing, along with this youngster, 15-year-old Keondrick Daniels. The Florida City boys are charged with second-degree murder with a deadly weapon in the death of 17-year-old Joltavius Williams, seen in this video from Grace Christian Preparatory School in Goulds. Police say he was killed when the two teens went to this homestead park with handguns, intending to shoot rival gang members. They reportedly approached an associate of Williams, and shots were fired. The teens will face another hearing January 30th. The state has announced its intent to review the case for direct file and to present the case to the grand jury. Do you understand that? Outside the courthouse, McKinney declined to talk about her son or the charges. The teens could be charged as adults. Well, my reaction is kind of bittersweet. Mark Coates, the pastor at Grace Christian, says he is relieved arrests have been made, but sorry about the loss of this youngster. As I have said, uh, you can never get good ends by evil means. And so uh, it's, my, it's my sincere prayer that this will continue to be a, com a community effort where we will produce more programs uh, that we can channel these kids into. The, the question that I, that I keep asking is, how are they able to get their hands on all of these guns? They're, they're coming from somewhere. Now, Miami-Dade police tell us the community played a vital role in helping identify the teens. Detective Alvaro Zabaleta said it's not clear, though, what motivated this incident and why Williams was shot. His girlfriend told us that he was going to be a father with a baby girl due in April. We're live in Homestead, Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.